Hey yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the brand new Honest Reaction video. So today we're listening to Silent Night by Dreamcatcher, of course. And it seems like if what I just pulled up on my phone is correct, A Right of Dream, this album, it seems like it was like their midpoint in their career, right? Because it was released back in 2019, so it's relatively new, but it's not the newest album. So curious to see what kind of sound quality they're gonna go for with this one. So let's begin here. But before we jump in, as always, guys, don't forget that on my Patreon, I've got more than 500 exclusive reactions to BTS, Twice, Red Velvet, live stage reactions and k-dramas like my mister and hotel de luna so if you'd like to see all of that and much more content make sure to check it out the link is going to be down below okay so let's go let's do it Do you guys know what I'm about to say? Do you guys know? Do you want to go down in the comments and, and, and comment it before I say it? You want to try to guess? By the way, guys, have you clicked that like button? I don't think it's blue. So if it's not blue, go make sure you, you change that. Because uh, it really, really helps the video. But the thing is with this one. I don't, <laughs> it, it's a very strange feeling like when, when I like a, a, the intro part of the song very, very much. It's almost like I don't want to continue because, because I want to keep this excitement. I want to maintain the feeling of not knowing what, what it's about, what's about to come. Uh, but the intro is really good. I like this uh, gentle guitar riff right here, right? And that gentle, whatever, maybe it's a violin, maybe it's something else. But it's slowly just increasing in volume, right? Pretty sure you can hear it in the background right there. And here, listen to the kicks, L listen to the beat. Mmm. Okay. whatever you want to call it it sounds so good mm. GU sounds, everyone sounds wonderful, but GU sounds particularly wonderful with this mellow instrumental, but you see, it's building up, it's building up to something, it's gaining the intensity. Oh. 
Okay, okay, so... Okay. First, uh, whatever she's saying here, it also sounds really, really good. In this low tone, right? And this part, I expected something completely different. I thought, you know, the guitars are gonna come in, it's gonna be like super powerful, kind of like Deja Vu or something like that, a Boca maybe. I was expecting that, but no. You know what, so, um... See, you see, so the instrumental feels, even though it's it's filled with different little details, ding, 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 like there, here, do, 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 stuff is happening, but still at the same time, it's pretty empty. It feels like it's empty, it's like, it's clear. You can see through it. Their voices are the main focus and the instrumental is just there, you know, it's like, it's spaced out. And I remember, um, now, I'm, I'm gonna make this analogy, but I'm not implying that anyone copied anyone. But uh, um, I remember I heard the same thing with Twice's Oxygen. I noticed that, so you can go back and uh, check out my reaction to that. But yeah, you know, despite not being what I expected it to be, I really, really like it. I really like it. Let's keep going and, and re-listen uh, re to it again. Mm -hmm. And these are the details that I was talking about. You hear that? The drums, right? The drums that are going from your left ear to the right side. And also that almost classical um, addition to the instrumental. Dun, 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 that kind of thing. Oh, Dami, nice, nice. Wait, guys, hold on. Before before you continue, I'm I'm just quickly gonna restart the camera because I I feel like I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna take a long time with this one, so I don't want my camera to stomp on me. So I'm gonna do that now. All right, and I'm back. Rewind just a little bit. The vocals in this part, they're like tin, 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 tin. I, I like that. I like that there's some space between their lines.
Is it is it speeding up? Is it speeding up? What? <laughs> this is gonna be an instrumental, I guess. Yo, guys, this was such a cool addition right here at the end. Wow, and listen, just listen to their voices. Yeah, this is cool. This is really cool. And just purely the type of sounds that they're using to create this instrumental, I, I really, really like them. Yeah, everything is working in the song so far for me. Yeah, whoa. Okay, now let's check out the lyric video for it because I want to know what it's about. Okay. Okay, look at the pictures. God, everyone's so beautiful. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so here's the thing guys, I, I have to get used to Handong's voice because so far I've mostly been listening to uh, their music where Handong was absent and uh, you know, the shows, um, the clips that I watched outside of their art. I I haven't been used to Handung's voice because again she wasn't present, so yeah it's gonna take a little bit of time. I'll I'll pay more attention to you know actively recognize her her voice, but we're gonna be okay. This with the blade, the blade thing kind of reminds me of Deja Vu. Because I think it was Yuyon, right? She was holding the blade, that sword, pointing to Ziyu. Then, yeah, and then she let go of the blade and like started to walk away. Ziyu grabbed it and attacked Yuyon. 
Oh, maybe maybe they're connected. Maybe they're connected. I think yeah, Deja Vu is from the same album. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So Wow, 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 this little ad lib gets me every time. The speeding up thing is pretty subtle. But I'm kind of glad that I noticed it. Okay, yeah, so yes, this this was Silent Night by Dreamcatcher, okay. Yeah, guys, I mean, as you can tell from the reaction, I don't think it's gonna be a surprise to anyone. I really, really enjoyed this one. Probably gonna be one of my favorite B-side tracks by Dreamcatcher. You know, lately I've been listening to Break the Wall a lot. I, oh, I love it, I love that song so much. Yeah, and this one, I will certainly, like, once I finish with this, finish with my work, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm definitely gonna go listen to this one on my speakers this time because I want to experience it on a different audio device. Yeah, it's awesome. It's awesome. Just like I said, I love the details, the little details, right? But at the same time, everything feels in the instrumental. Everything feels pretty spread out. And you actually can catch those details. It's not coming at you all at the same time, right? And their voices fit into this whole picture very, very nicely as well. So beautiful. They're switching from one member to another. Like, yeah, it's very engaging. And the outro catches you by surprise and a very, very nice addition uh, for, to the end of the song. So yeah. Enjoyed this one tremendously. Thank you everyone on Patreon for voting for this one. And with this said, I'll catch you all in in my next video as always, guys. Take care. Keep listening to great music. Stand talent, stand dreamcatcher, and love.